Wildman Jones, waking up with stories, reporting on the dream world. Um, something has begun to happen in the dream world, maybe a week back, maybe a little longer. Uh, the dreams are becoming so coherently tight, tight like tiger, tight like tiger. I saw every bit of my relatives. I was shown every bit of my bloodline. I went all the way back to the DNA. The German, the Indian, the German and the Indian, the German and Indian, the English, the Welsh, the Dutch, all of it. They all danced. They all fucking danced around. Yes, they all danced around. They even purchased a small little place. And then and then they fortified it just so that it could be I don't know. They could have a fucking some weird event there that was like a cowboy and western show. I'm not done. I'm not done. I went with Amanda all the way to one other side of the world because you know the Chinese and shit. And that was weird. That's how it all started. And it ended up being me and the little, me and the little girl were friends. That's the little daughter that supposedly the um, Nepalese guy's kid. It ended up actually being not that case. It was some other guys. It was all a ruse to play uh, some deep, um, some sort of deep cover weird shit they always do with the Asians and the corner store guys, like a co-op. Like you watch my back, I watch yours sort of thing. The cops and the towelhead dudes. I know that sounds strange. That's not. That's a tangent. That's not the point. <laughs> Somewhere in the middle of the night. They, and then, what was it? The, um, the Planck frequency equation? The second most important equation in physics? Oh yeah. Don't think we forgot about that. The Planck frequency has now been changed out. It was the prior frequency that was negative. It did have a frequency, a low vibration carrier wave. It is now conducting the higher frequency that is in harmonic resonance with the Planck length, which was not the case before, or these streams would not be spreading out so rapidly in both directions. That was the problem with the negative frequency. Yeah, yeah, I know. So, um, currently my dead grandmother is <laughs> somewhere in the astral world over, um, where, where is it? Hold on. Um, damn it. Anyway, e between here and Austin, there's a place, and there's a reason why it's there, because of the weird bendy, spacey difference of space-time and time-space. And it's okay. But I had to, like, they had to put me through the test to be, um, I don't know, the same thing that allows me to have a job is the same thing that happened to me on the other side of the dream. Grandmother wanted to make sure I wasn't gonna screw it up or something like that. Very strange. I, don't, I really don't know how to articulate it. I wouldn't be even recording it if it were not so profound. Because I, I have these dreams and, the, and I go into them and then I keep coming out going in. I'm, I'm, they're lucid, totally lucid. But they have a lot to do with our ability to be do to two bodied. Is that right? I think that's what they say from the. Law one. They call us the two bodied. Yeah, it's something like that. So don't worry. If I can look at you on camera with this crazy wild man face and not worry and tell you that hey, I think this shit's happening. Then then you can rest assured that I can look at this crazy wild man face. Yeah, yeah, you see that? Total wild man. Straight up out the bed.